What's up guys, welcome back to another video. I know it's been so long since I've done one of these extended talk through cooking videos. There's just been so much going on, but I'm back and ready to share with you lots of healthy and delicious recipes. To kick things off, I want to share with you how I make my daily post-workout smoothie. This is what I'm usually having in the mornings during the week when I don't have much time to make anything after my workout. I love having a smoothie in the morning because it's an easy way to ease into the day and it's usually easier on your digestive system to be able to break down the food. I find this to be very helpful for my clients who suffer from digestive issues. And whether you have digestive issues or not, breakfast should be a meal that's not too heavy on your stomach since you've been fasting for some time while sleeping. Incorporating a smoothie in your morning is also a great way to get lots of nutritious foods in effortlessly. I know a lot of you want to eat more greens and nutrient-dense foods but struggle to find ways to incorporate them into your diet. Smoothies, in my opinion, are the best way to do that. They're also great for kids because you can pack them with greens and nutrient-dense ingredients that they won't even notice them being in there. The full recipe of the smoothie can be found in my Meal Prep Made Easy ebook, which is gonna be linked down below. Make sure to check it out if you're looking for meal prep inspiration and tips. So, all right, let's get into the recipe. I'm gonna walk you through the ingredients we're going to need. All right, so we're gonna start off with one cup of unsweetened almond milk, half a cup of frozen blueberries, we're gonna do one tablespoon of almond butter, one tablespoon of flax seeds, and one tablespoon of cacao powder. And then we also have a handful of spinach. Mine is frozen, that's why it's looking like that, but you can use fresh or frozen, whatever you like. And then we also have two scoops of collagen, and you can also use any type of protein powder that you like. I just really love incorporating collagen into um, my daily life. And then we're also adding a little bit of cinnamon to this. So all these ingredients are gonna keep your blood sugar stable for at least three hours. Because we don't have any high glycemic foods here, you won't feel those highs and lows in blood sugar and energy levels after having this smoothie. The flax seeds in this smoothie are also gonna be a great source of fiber and omega-3 fats, which are going to help keep you feeling fuller longer. The cacao powder and blueberries are full of great antioxidants, which help fight free radicals in the body. And did you know that cacao can be a natural mood elevator and antidepressant? It's pretty crazy how you can get these amazing benefits from just the food you eat. And I find that to be really fascinating. So it's pretty simple guys. All you're going to do is add all of these ingredients to a high speed blender and blend for about 30 seconds to a minute. So lastly, I just like to top my smoothie with some grain free granola like this one by Purely Elizabeth or this one by Wild Way. These are my favorite types of grain free granola. They just add some texture and crunch to the smoothie and make it so much better. If you don't have granola on hand, it's all cool. Um, you can just drink the smoothie on its own and it tastes just as good. I hope you guys try this recipe out. Let me know what you think. I'd love to hear from you. Also, let me know what type of things you guys like to eat post-workout. I'm always looking for new and delicious recipes to incorporate into my day, so I'd love to hear your thoughts. Thank you guys so much for watching and I will catch you in the next video.